Kimla takes care of the house, secures our future. That's what I married him for. He's the head and I'm the neck. And the head can't turn without the neck. I would take out the hammer, you know, the screwdriver, and do the hard stuff. I would be like, you're not a man. Ooh, that's, those are the things that I would say. No, that's bad. So if you could, you would take those words back? Absolutely. When I see Alicia and Kemma together, Alicia just smiles at whatever he's saying, and she doesn't really say much. I'm so, excuse me, I'm ready for sweetheart. It's a little bit much for my first party here in Atlanta. Give, give me five minutes. We'll finish up a, a serious conversation. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you have a good time. A second, yeah. When he's not around, she's very opinionated. She's outspoken. You guys got to have a one-on-one. -on -one. But not in the group setting. Not in this group setting. So I know when he's around, that's an act. She's putting on for the people. So what you hear from both, all of us is watch your words. Right. Yeah. But it takes years. It takes years. One, so thing, that, one, one thing I know about Gregory, he's a problem solver, and there's, there's times I get upset with him, and I'm like, I just want you to hear me. Like, and he's like, well, I, I, I want to solve the problem. But here is the thing. Men and women are wired completely different. different. He's they never going to think like yeah, you. Right, You're right. never going to think like him. Thank God, and you don't want them to. And the oh, yeah. earlier and you realize that, really, the better. Mm -hmm. It's a lie. It's a lie. You got to love them. Because if you lie. don't, God dang, it's too much. <laughs> <laughs>